Hey guys, welcome to the Yachtcast. We're in Hawaii on a very special afternoon. It's really special for this boy right here. It's Finn <laughs> McGill. He just won the Pipeline Masters Trials and he's got a wild card into the main event. Congratulations, Finn. Thank you, sir. How was your day? It was uh, epic, hey? You really, um, you know, especially in that semi final, you got a 9 5. And then in the final, you're on fire. You got pretty much every good wave. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I was so stoked out there. I mean, I've been serving out here since I was like, like five years old, six wow. years old. So like just small and been working up for forever. <laughs> and I'm stoked to finally get a couple in a heat. Like, I mean, we have a couple of juniors here, but it's never really good, so. Yeah, right. Yeah. And uh, you, I mean, obviously this is the first time you've made the Pike Masters, but you have competed out here before in junior events. Yes, I have, but I mean, sure. it's nothing close to this. Like, yeah, it's, it's in like kind of a bad time of year, so. Yeah. You grew up right here. You went to school across the street. Yeah, I went to school across the street till sixth grade. And Always watching the Pipe Masters since you were like. Yeah, young. I remember actually being in class and listening to the scores. Really? And I was always so stoked on the and scores. And now you're in the Pipeline Masters. Yeah, that that is unbelievable. So cool. Um, you've actually had a pretty good season because you made the final in the HIC, the first event. Yeah. Um, of the season, that was really good. You surfed really well at sunset then. Thank you. So. Yeah, it's just been, have you expected that it would be this good? And um, you really grew a lot last year, and uh, so um, you're ready to go, aren't you? Yeah, I wasn't expecting that at all, actually. I was just like, wanted to get into the Triple Crown. That was my main goal. Yep. And then you did that by qualify uh, by the HIC? By the HIC, yeah. Yep. And I, I think I only needed to make like two heats in the HIC, and then I was just kind of, after those two heats, I just kind of like relaxed, and I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just right. going to have fun and I just like had, had a blast and I ended up making the finals and then did okay at You did Oliva. okay at Haliba, didn't you? Like, I, then, I was watching, what did you get to the quarters or? No, I only made before? one round. Oh, okay. But That's yeah, right. I had a pretty, pretty sh weird heat in the second round. Yeah. It was just big and nasty. And, it was big and nasty. Yeah. And then did okay at sunset and then come here and I just wanted to, I just wanted to catch a couple waves. Like, mm. yeah, it's rare to get three other guys out out here like yeah. with 30 minutes it's unbelievable so yeah and uh so you're 16 uh you still in school i'm homeschooled you're homeschooled so now. sorta sorta sort of in school <laughs> yeah <laughs> um <laughs> and you must be like have your eyes on the qs would that be like next year or oh uh, yeah so when do you turn 17 uh april april yeah okay so uh, and I think I got into the primes next year, so I might be going to do all of those and oh, stuff. You, you can get in primes next yeah. year? Yeah. So Sick. I'm, I think I'm going to go and do the, the Q grind. <laughs> You're going to do it? Yeah. Unreal. Yeah, That's I'm great so news. stoked. Yeah. So psyched. And when you woke up this morning and you saw the waves, they weren't actually that good, but they kind of got better all day. Were you um, stoked that they were running or...? What did you think when you saw the waves this morning when you woke up? Yeah, I mean, I woke up, I came, I drove down here and I was just watching it and I was just like, oh, they're not going to run. Like, yeah, it, it's not possible. And I sat for like an hour just watching it, like just in case. And then uh, Reynos Hayes came down and he was talking to us. He's like, dude, they're going to run. Like, it's yeah. going to get better at like nine ish. Mm. And uh, like they have to run, basically. Yeah. So. I started getting ready, I just kind of went out there, caught a couple ways, did a couple turns. Luckily I was like heat eight in first round, so I was just kind of yeah. cruising, watching. And then by my heat, it got super good. And just yeah. like, yeah. yeah. And I was so pumped up. I mean, just to get a couple ways with nobody out, it's just amazing <laughs> out there. Like, it, it's so rare to even get it out there with like 20 guys, yeah. 20 other guys. So like, three other guys, just unbelievable. It's like, Every way that comes in is basically yours, like. It pretty much is, yeah. yeah, yeah. And you're working with that priority system yeah. too, which is epic. Yeah. And um, you're a Billabong rider. How long have you been riding for Billabong for? Uh, two years. Two years at, now. At, as of January, two years, yeah. Yeah, cool. They've got to be stoked with that. <laughs> I mean, it was your day today and like far out. Was, uh, how much money did you win? I think I won 10 grand today. 10 grand, no <laughs> yeah. Way. That's gonna help on the QS. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> a little bit, all right. 
And so your goals are just to try and qualify next year? Like, it's not, I mean, I reckon it's really possible. I mean, <laughs> Gabrielle, myself, qualified at 17 years old about that. So yeah. I wish you all the best of luck with that. Thank you. And um, were your parents here to meet you? Uh, yeah, my parents were down the beach a little bit. They ran right. up to the Coffin's house. And, oh, they did? Yeah. So they were just talking to them for a while. And then uh, I think they went home because they had... Uh, they had to meet with some people at our house, but okay. I'm just cruising. It's so stunning. You yeah. can't get that smile off your face. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> <laughs> That's all time. Um, so tomorrow, it might be on. What are you going to do tonight? Early uh, bed. Are you tired? I'm really tired right now. Uh, you four times I started today. getting like cramps and stuff in my last seat. I was kind of tired and beat, but I'm um, so stoked. I mean, I'll probably wake up with so much adrenaline tomorrow. Just. <laughs> You wake up and yeah. say, did that happen? Yeah. I'm in the corners. Won't even believe it tomorrow. And uh, I'm just stoked to be in the Pipe Masters. I like, can't even believe that. I'm just baffled. All time, all time. Well, thanks for being on the Yachtcast, and I wish you all the best of luck. Thank you, Ock. In the contest. Thank you. Yeah, and um, good luck with your qualification next year, too. Thank you. I'll be watching you, <laughs> and I really, I really think you can make it. And you've got a big future, boy. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's the Yachtcast, and we'll see you guys next time.